what's up guys welcome back to my channel thank you so much for tuning in and if you're new here please do subscribe we are literally literally less than 50 subscribers away from 10k so i would really appreciate it if you guys would subscribe so in today's video i'm showing you guys how i undo my wig cornrows um i'm not really a natural hair youtuber because i myself i'm still learning from the likes of kanye samono um sino Mongliwa, um and there's a lady i think she's called all things via or via but it's all things via um so i watch a lot of her youtube videos as well and basically what i'm showing you guys is how i undo my wig cornrows as you guys saw they've been um older than a week so yeah it's time to go now <laughs> so what i'm doing now is i'm basically like drenching my hair with um some water mixed with leave-in conditioner and i'm just going to make sure that each and every cornrow is drenched with um water before i undo the plaits first simply because my hair is really really dry and um i just don't want to break it and um harm it in any way by undoing the plaits while it's dry so by spraying my hair with water it basically um prevents it from breaking well it does break but it breaks less than it would if i undo the cornrows um while my hair is dry not sure if you guys get it but yeah So as you guys can see my hair is much softer and i have a low porosity hair sending love to tango low porosity can go guys because of okanye so i and so i have low porosity hair um as you guys can see the water is literally sitting on top of my hair um it's taking quite a while for it to penetrate through my hair strands so yeah i just wanted to show you guys that i'm learning something <laughs> But anyway, I'm just going to continue um, undoing my plaits and I'll speak to you guys as we go by. So as you guys can see, the water is still sitting on top of my hair um, at the back and on the other side. The water basically penetrated through my hair strands but on this side that i'm currently unplatting you guys can see that there is um some water and it's quite white because of the product that i've been using while i had cornrows so the water is kind of like activating that product as well as the leave-in conditioner of course that i'm using um is the reason why the water has like white residue so i'm just gonna finish undoing this last cornrow and then i'm gonna go to the bathroom and get ready to wash my hair Okay, so I'm in the bathroom now and I'm using this Clix Curls um, Hydrating and Soothing Conditioner. I'm basically doing a co-wash because Kanisa said I shouldn't wash my hair with shampoo. So I only like use shampoo once a month or once maybe two months. And I'm not going to show you guys the whole process of me washing hair because it's a bit messed up. So um, in the clip that you guys are seeing now, I detangled my hair using the raking method i think that's what it's called so as you guys can see i'm now able to run my fingers through um my curls and it's dehydrated and then i'm gonna go wash out the conditioner and i'm gonna show you guys how i do my twists So 
so to do my twist i'm going to use clean water and then i'm also going to use this afro botanics aloe vera and marula um, oil and then for my cream i'm going to use the clicks um curl power hydrating curl cream guys i'm literally running out of each and every single product because of this lockdown and the fact that it's extended is <laughs> wow son and basically so normally i would use that much hair to do one twist but i watched um aluvenguza's igtv natural hair video and she was basically showing us how she does um wig twists so i'm trying this out for the first time and i think i pretty much like it um so i'm doing smaller twists than usual and I feel like this method is going to help me more because I'll be able to untie, um, undo my wig twist rather, do the lock method and then twist again. And I feel like it's going to be easier for me to wash my hair in smaller wig twists than it is when I cornrow my hair. So I don't think I'm going to cornrow my hair anymore because I feel like this um, method that I saw Aluve do is going to work for me well. And the reason why she did... Um, smaller twists than like the normal size twist is because she wears wigs like i do a lot so um by having smaller twists you basically are, are going to be able to tie them up or um keep them back with um hair grips in order for your hair to be flat so that you can still wear wigs regardless of the twists you have underneath so as you guys can see now i'm doing the lock method <laughs> so basically i'm using water obviously as liquid um, I'm using the Afro Botanics oil as well as the Clicks um, Curl Power Hydrating Curl Cream. And then I'm just going to do the lock method. You guys probably know the lock method. If you don't, you can check out Kanyesa Sino. Um, who else do I watch? Oh, Balisa on Instagram. Um, I'll link all of the details down below in the description box so that you guys can go watch, wa watch their channels um and yeah this is basically what i'm going to do and then i'm going to show you guys how um the wig twist turned out in the end and i hope that you guys liked this video um it's something different i never really do natural hair content on my channel but maybe i'm going to start doing it now but um as like a growing process for me to not necessarily to teach you guys because i don't know much i'm still learning myself and yeah you guys i'm pretty much happy with the hair with the way my hair is growing um if you guys remember i cut my hair last year in november um gosh i got literally like two centimeters of the growth that i had i cut all my hair off i had very long blown out hair but it was just breaking it was dry i did not love it anymore so i watched um Akakanyisa and her story her reason why she basically started a natural hair journey i could relate more to it because it was basically a similar situation so i also decided to just snip it off and i am extremely happy with my decision so yeah maybe in, in my next video i'll insert clips um like snaps showing you guys the day i actually went to go cut my hair i think i still have those snaps and show you guys how long my hair was before i chopped it off so let me know if you guys would like to see that and thank you so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this video please do give it a thumbs up comment down below and subscribe to my channel and i hope that you guys are staying safe at home um just so that we can get through this pandemic and i love all of you guys thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next time Thank you.